Fans who are all former athletes looking to get back to their glory days by getting trimmed. Tonight's big picture. Can the biggest loser come back? Can the biggest loser be a winner again? Congratulations to Rachel! Here's how the show will shift the focus away from Rachel Fredrickson's 155-pound weight loss drama and retool the 16th season. You want those glory days back, and that is why you are standing here today. <laughs> yeah? First, they are calling it the Biggest Loser Glory Days this season because many of the contestants are former world-class athletes who aren't strangers to the media spotlight. Well, I was a 12-year uh, veteran of the National Football League, uh, won two Super Bowls. Your starting weight is 388 pounds. <sighs> to my chest, eight. I don't stop, you don't stop, come on! Then they replaced Jillian Michaels with not one, but two very good-looking trainers, Jennifer Wiederstrom and Jesse Pavelka. Football's over, come on, up and down, up and down. Come on, man, don't drop that. And random fact of the day, Jesse's cousin is former bachelor Jake Pavelka. The training we know, but being put in this situation, it's kind of that fish out of water for us as well. Jesse, when he looks at you with those eyes, you're like, what do you want me to do and how much do you want me to do it? <laughs> Are you ready to get started? Yeah. Yeah. It's go time. And if there's one thing you can count on, it's the emotional stories that pull at our heartstrings. My wife passed away nine months ago. We were married 28 years. And um, before she passed away, we were in the hospital and she was holding my hand. And uh, she said, I need you to promise me something. You have to take care of yourself. My dad passed away six months ago from uh, complications from diabetes and he was over 400 pounds and uh, he died a very graphic and slow death. And I saw my future. It's a big step for me. Everything that you thought you knew about this show has been thrown out the window. Another new twist is Comeback Canyon. Just when an eliminated contestant thinks they're heading home, they will actually be taken to a secret location where trainer Bob Harper will be waiting. So what happens is once there are two people at Comeback Canyon, they will have a week with me and whoever wins a weigh-in between the two of them, they'll stay at Comeback Canyon. The other person will get um, then officially eliminated and then the next person will come in.